Jersey Sports Zone's regional championship coverage at Rutgers is being brought to you by Ocean First Bank. A regional championship game at Rutgers. The South Central Group 3 title game between Woodrow Wilson and Cedar Creek. It's the second meeting of the season between these teams with the Pirates winning round one back in September. The Tigers force an early Creek fumble and then cash in on offense. Devin Cargeman to Mike Estramera. Touchdown Wilson. Cargeman also hits Estramera on a two-point conversion to take an eight-zip lead. Next Creek possession, the Tigers come up with another takeaway. Will Love makes the interception. Love returns it deep into Pirates territory. It leads to a one-yard QB sneak from Cargeman for a score. 16-0 Wilson. The Tigers force another fumble on the next drive to get the ball right back again. Cargeman fakes the handoff and he's going deep. A 37-yard strike to Love for the touchdown. We're less than five minutes into the game and Woodrow Wilson leads 22 to nothing. Cedar Creek gets on the board later in the first. J.C. Landesini to Jaquan Howard. Howard hits pay dirt for the Pirates. Creek still down though, 22 to seven after one. Second quarter, Pirates on the move again. Landesini rolling to his right, connects with Elijah Smalls along the far side for a score. Cedar Creek chipping away here, now down by eight. Time running out in the half now, a chance for the Pirates to pull even at intermission, but Estramera makes the interception in the end zone. The Tigers' fourth takeaway of the half. As a block in the back would negate some of Estramera's return as time expires. 22-14 Wilson at the break. Third quarter, the Tigers march right down the field on the opening possession. Cargeman on the QB sneak again. Devin Cargeman's second rushing touchdown of the night makes it 28 to 14. The Pirates with an answer. Landesini airs it out to Zach Ricky, and Ricky makes the grab for a score. 12 yards on the TD toss from Landesini to Ricky makes it 28 to 21. This is the ensuing kickoff. Estramera fields it on the run at the 20, and look out! Mike Estramera gets to the far sideline, and he's gone. The senior doing it all for the Tigers on the big stage. 80 yards to the house to make it a two-score game once again. 34-21 Wilson. Here comes Creek again, though. Landesini connects with Jojo Bermudez, and the Cincinnati commit says, see ya. Bermudez is gone for a 70-yard house call. The Pirates just refuse to go away. They trail by six, heading to the fourth. Three and a half minutes to go now. Landesini surveys the field and hits Ricky over the middle. Zach Ricky splits a pair of defenders, sprinting for the end zone, and he's in there. A 49-yard strike from Landesini to Ricky to tie the game at 34. Matt Best adds an extra point to give Creek its first lead of the night. All right, 14 seconds left. The Tigers facing fourth and goal from the seven. Cargeman to Nasir Oglesby. C.J. Resto there to make the tackle as Oglesby stretches into the end zone. The official rules him down just inches short of the goal line. Video review being used for this game. And after a lengthy review, the call on the field stands. Cedar Creek makes a goal line stand to cap off a crazy comeback as the Pirates complete a perfect season with a regional championship. 35 to 34 the final. It's the first perfect season and the first regional title in school history at Cedar Creek. What an unforgettable night at Rutgers. It's a game of inches, man. It's the, it's the best feeling a kid from A. Carbon City could do, man. I dream, I dreamed of just wanting to play football for A. Carbon City, Cedar Creek. I did it, man. I lived the dream of, you know, small town kid doing it for the city, man. This is the best, this is the best year of my life. He's the best. He's the best. Feels great, honestly, because I'm a senior, so it feels great to go 13 0 my last year. We got a bunch of dogs on our team, so I mean, I was I was expecting it this year, honestly. This feeling, this feeling is real good, man. It's a great feeling. Um, we came out um all summer and worked hard for this moment, so man, this this is a great feeling. You know, that's a cliche thing that you know it's it's hard to beat a team twice. We beat a really good team twice, um, you know. And but listen, we we've done that all year. You know, we ran through a really hard schedule, guys. And and you know, I I've said it before. I really do believe that our division this year was the best in the state uh, for public school football. Um, and you know that, that we were battle tested. So were they. So were they. So it was it was uh, it was really just a, a heavyweight fight, and uh, it went down to the finish, man, on the inch line. A perfect 13 and 0 for Cedar Creek as the Pirates party in Piscataway. A heartbreaker for Woodrow Wilson 
as the Tigers finished the season with a sectional title and a record of 9-3. and three. At Rutgers, I'm Mike Frankel, JerseySportsZone.com.